everyone and welcome back to my vid video, it is my video, but welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I am Sam, I'm a mum of two boys, um, and it's probably best to watch the prior video. I will try and link that up at the top, if I remember, but it will have been the one before this, um, where I have sat and done a budget, a monthly plan, blah blah blah, because as we all know, the living crisis at the moment is pretty crazy. Um, now, I used to shop this way a long while ago and I haven't done it for, I, don't, I can't remember the last time, but today, which is the 9th of June, is my first day of my month, in a sense of money-wise. So, I've actually gone this month and done what I used to do, which was a really big monthly shop. Um, and now I am lucky I've got a chest visa out in the garage. Um, and actually essentially a spare kitchen out there that I can store stuff out there um, but I try and get as much as I can in the kitchen and that's in this kitchen because I find that if I do a monthly shop that when I need to top up like bread, milk, fridge stuff because that will all be, that's the only things I'll need and I go with a list, I stick to the list now if I do a weekly shop with a list I never ever stick to it but when I know it's just the basics I need, I tend to stick to my list. So that's what I've done this month. I've been to Aldi and I've been to the Iceland Warehouse. Now they do bigger packets, um, which are work out at better money. So the next door to each other where I am. So I've gone and done that. So let's just see what I've got. Because I've got, I think, over 160 items to get through. So you have to bear with me here. But... That is Iceland over that side. This is Aldi along this side. And then I've got some pop and cat food down there as well. So let's just jump straight in. <laughs> the lighting is absolutely rubbish, so I do apologise. Um, so I've got some cleaning bits. So I got a, a, a Fabulosa kitchen spray, um, a carpet refresher. I have none of these. Bin bags, not got any. Some bubble bath. Then I've bought Aldi's like floor cleaner. Aldi's, I've not tried this one, but I do like Aldi's, I'm crinkling that packet, I do like Aldi's washing powder, but that's a coconut and it's called Coconut Crush. Um, so I've got washing powder, some um, sanitary products, some toothpaste, what else is it that is, oh, washing up liquid, things like that that I know I'm going to run out of in the month. I may not be out just now, but I know I'll run out before the end of the month. I've got two packets of crisps because crisps were really was empty. Um, I'll leave that one on the floor. I've got four bottles of flavoured water for Alfie. We put these in his bottles for school because um, he won't. He drinks them more than plain. Two bottles of squash because we've already got one and a half in the cupboard. Like I said before, washing up liquid. Toilet rolls. Again, I'm not out of them just yet, but I know that I will need them before the month end. So I got toilet rolls. Um, I got a little bit for the freezer from Aldi. Got some of these pork patties, um, some milk, buttermilk fish burgers, me and Alfie love fish, and some of these buttermilk chicken thigh burgers. These are incredible, absolutely incredible. Um, these were new, so these are little potato stars and some little like waffle fries. But again, I think they're new to Aldi. It doesn't say I'm new, it does. Um, I'm moving all my bags out of the way on the floor. I've got a light flickering. I've got some kitchen roll because again I'll be run out before the end of the month. We've got some gravy granules, some garlic and herb like dip mayo type thing, some tomato puree. Then I've stocked up on tins. So there is I only got one of those. I thought I got two. Um, the meatballs and gravy. We've got six tins of beans. We've got five tins of chopped tomatoes, two tins of beans and sausage, two tins of spaghetti, some peas. I have got these in the freezer, but I just wanted to try and add little bits to my stock of tins. So two peas, one sweet corn and four packs of tuna. I've got, I've got quite a few of these in the cupboard already, but um, a pasta sauce. And then treating myself to some posh pasta. I love tagliatelle. Um, so I've got one of those with, I haven't tried this before, their tomato and mascarpone pasta sauce. Lovely big plane going over. 
Um, I got some jelly for Alfie because I thought that might be a cheap snack. I got a pack of four yogurts because we've got, I think, a couple of in the fridge that Alfie likes already. Some sour cream. Now, all these have really good dates on them. I mean, that's got 24th on. I think these have got the 30th. So these are what Dylan likes. Um, so these are custard and those ones are apple. I've got, like I say, if you've watched the previous video, you'll know what I've got in my freezer. I've just got some mints, some chicken portions. That is nearly a kilogram. And then these were only £3.50 for six pork chops. Um, this is tea tomorrow. So some triple cheese dirty fries, garlic dip and a stuffed crust cheese pizza. I got some sausage rolls, a garlic baguette. Two lots of milk, so I do this because I don't want to do my I don't want to do a weekly top up. I want to do a two weekly top up. So I buy a filtered one that's got a longer date on it and a normal one. We open this one first, and that one will sit in the fridge. Fresh bits. I have got a few bits of like onions and stuff in the fridge, but these were on the Super Six. They were seventy p vine tomato specialty ones, and so was. These on the Super 6. Now, yes, I do grow rhubarb, but my little mini stems aren't ready for picking and it is rhubarb season, so those were 70p as well. I got some apples, cooking apples. I think these are like 47p each and they're massive. We got broccoli, bananas, um, savoy... Yeah, I was going to say, I thought I had it wrong then. Savoy cabbage, because that looks really good. Some carrots potatoes and their wonky peppers now these some of these were really soft in the bag so i made sure that i got the ones that are really firm because they want to take them out of the bag they will last absolutely ages um i plan to make a mixed like half and half crumble so half apple and then half apple and rhubarb um because dylan might eat rhubarb weird I've got some pan of chocolate because again these norm I didn't check the dates on these. I'm gonna say these normally do have a long date on them. Where are you? Where is it? There. So these have got July on them. So again, I'll probably put these out away so the boys don't know they're there and then pull them out in the second week of my shop. I got a dinner kit, a fajita kit. We love those. I got some saurine. Again, these will be put away. Great things to put away. I got some noodles for the month. Um, again, I, I've got a weird eating habit. I don't really eat until tea time. And then because I don't sleep, I tend to have something about 10 o'clock. And it tends to be noodles because it's quick and easy. I picked up some, because I didn't have many crisps, I picked up some different things to kind of for the boys to have with their lunches. So I've got some cheese twists. I got some cheese little sharing tub crackers. The light is like shining. And I got some like Ritz crackers as well. I love these and so does Dylan. Um, but again, they can be put instead of a packet of crisps just on the plate. I've got some little buns. Oh, and a loaf of bread that I nearly forgot. And then, who has tried these? We, I, we haven't tried them yet. So these are like As Aldi's. Subway rolls where the cheese and herb. So I thought something different again for lunchtime because if the boys are bored of just sandwich crisps and yogurt and stuff. Um, so I got those. Packet of biscuits. Again, some of these will be put out of sight from the boys. Because um, once they know they're there, I don't... So I got a butter. I got um, a chocolate spread. I've got some mozzarella. Again, this has got a really, really good date on it. So that will sit in and wait. This has got the 23rd on. So these are great for like pasta bakes or if you're making your own pizzas, which is super cheap to make. Um, they've got a good date. I picked these up for the boys. They love pepperoni pizzas. Um, and Alfie was saying about making his own pizza. Um, so I thought, do you know what? They could cut these up if they didn't want to eat them as like little snacks. Um, again, they're new in. Again, some of the biscuits to kind of put out of the way. It feels really hard because if I know these are there at the moment and obviously they're a monthly shop, it's, it's calling to eat them. But I got two packets of ham because again, they've got the end of the month on. So like I say, I'm hoping to do a two-week shop at least. A month stock, 
a month's stock shop and at least a two week shop before I go back to the shops if that makes sense for a top up so I've got two lots of the honey loop cereal this is what Alfie really likes at the moment I got some choco pillows and then I got these for Dylan these are new in um, he likes chocolate Weetabix so these are chocolate protein Weetabix um, so I thought actually they may be really filling for him I don't know how much protein is in them though let's have a look um so per two biscuits oh wow it's only got 6.3 it's not like massively but um i just thought we can try those now down the middle aisle i avoided like the plague but they had cat food and dog they had, like cat and dog stuff so i've got four of these no i've got three of these two kilograms which will last me way more than a month um but yeah, I got those in the dry food and then, oh, there's the other bag. And then in these, they had this giant 80, which for my cats, if it's 30 days in the month, I need 10 more, but it's near enough a month's worth. These were 18.99, I think. Um, and they'll, they'll think this is a massive treat. <laughs> I got some bottles of their like Pepsi and then I've got three lots of water um they might not last till in two weeks we shall see um it's guzzling water like no tomorrow at the minute um onto the aldi stuff that i got from al no iceland warehouse i got two of these um again that's my pop sorted for the whole month um but i realized they've overcharged me charged me single price when it's not when they're in a craze like this they are a price set price so i need to go back which is highly frustrating. So like I say, in the Owl Slim Warehouse, they have these big value packs. Um, so I think this was three pound, but this is like massive. It's two and a half kilos of French fries. These are mine and Dylan and Alfie's favorite chips ever. They're beef dripping skin on fries. They are incredible. Um, that's a big value pack. I got some little choc ices, some frozen garlic bread. Um, I love carrot and sweet mash and I've never seen I've never seen it in a big value pack so I've got one of those for myself. I got some little cocktail sausage rolls for like lunches once the fresh ones have run out. Um they can easily go in the air fryer. I got these are all our favourite again, these crispy chicken strips. Oh delish. Um I've got some little breaded nuggets. Um these were 66 nuggets and I think it was like two quid. They were really cheap. They had the pasta and sauce on offer, so there's five of those, two of the cheese and broccoli, and three of the leek ham, cheese, leek and ham. This was on offer at £2.75, and it is a big one, so 58 washes, and it's it's actually a coconut one, so I thought that would go well with my thing about Mayonnaise seems to be in short supply at the moment, so I've had to buy, like, a Hellman's one. They, that was only a pound, though. I got two of these because these were on offer. Um, I thought they were like syrups but to like put in ice, but you actually freeze these, so I thought they could be... I thought we'd me and Alfie would give them a go. Dylan doesn't eat anything like that. Holland's were on four for £10. Um, so I got a cheese pie, one of my favourites, steak and kidney puddings, some little mini cheese and onion pies, little mince and onion pies, and then I got two of the deep pan um frozen pizza as well that is mad oh so that so that was everything i got um i'm not looking forward to putting it away <laughs> um but yes i am going to try and do some like um cheap meals if i can work out like prices of things and like things to add into things to make it cheaper and spread it out and things like that but those videos take a little bit more time um but yeah i'm hoping and praying this works um i like i say i used to do it so it should work um and keep my little top-up shops to a very bare minimum so thank you for watching um i shall see you all really soon and i hope you enjoy the video goodbye